Live indeed. Live indeed. Going to share us to the appropriate places. Random place on the Facebook. All right. We did it. Maybe. Yes, we did. I can dig that. That's pretty cool. Hmm? This outfit that I got going on. Sweet deal. It's a super sweet deal. Whoa. Hello, stream. I'm Noah, and I'm joined by a couple of dudes here. Go ahead and introduce yourselves. I'm, I'm Dude Run. Uh, I'm Neko Junkie. Yay. So does that make me dude too, even though dude I'm not even, not even a dude? You could dude. be a dude that if you'd like. Dude. Dude yeah. one and du dude and do that. Yeah. Whoa. Be a dude. Also known as Space Break. And for tonight, we are streaming Suikoden, which is a game for the PlayStation 1. There are five games in the series and some guiding games. It's pretty good. I played the second one a bit, but... This first one is, uh, I'm gonna say mostly blind, because the only thing I'm not blind to is who I'm going to be recruiting later on, but other than that, mostly everything else is blind. As I don't know directions, I don't know everyone's personalities, I didn't know that the name Xavius that I named my main character would be very weird. And ironic, considering Xavius is a tree, Xavius. and this guy is obviously not a tree. Xavius is an evil mofo, and yes, and this Xavius. Well, we do have a uh, weird thing on us. Main character has a uh, magic rune thing called the Soul Eater, so I guess in a way it's kind of evil. I don't know. It's it's a weird thing. Anyway, last time we left off in the plot, we found an elf collapse on the shore of our base, and he wanted to come to us for help. Dash us for help or something. Because I guess someone wants to do genocide on a bunch of elves. Oh, shit. So, well, we're gonna stop that. No? None? Or the furry? Wait, what? No, I don't like those. Yeah. What, genocide on the elves? We don't like that. I don't think anyone no. likes that. No, of course not. Kev uh, dude over here was looking for some appearance options. Uh-huh. What does he want to- what does this person want to appear as? Oh, he's just, like doing like appearance options for, uh, Ms. Demon Hunter. I see. That's what he's doing. Ah. Uh. So I, I gave my opinion. And that opinion was, go hunt some demons, you yes. person who hasn't hunted enough demons. Exactly. Alright, so I'm supposed to go to this forest here. Or this town near a forest, I guess. Mm -hmm. Oh no, there's a dude. He's like... Oh, I wasn't seen coming out of here lately. Oh my god, you're an elf. Oh no. Referring to my party member who is an elf. Uh, we should sneak away. Okay, we have not been followed by douche canoes yet. Yeah, the area beyond here is under a spell. Without an elf, you'll get lost. That's good to know. I think I already am lost. Oh look! A person who might be lost. Oh god. Uh... Uh... What? A woman uh, appeared behind me, and she nice? suddenly wants- I don't know, she seems nice. 
We told her we have a castle, so join us. And we recruited a disappearing and reappearing mage named Vicky. And we're like fighting against... Like that. Wait, what? Well then, I'm talking to myself. Uh, huh. Yeah, I'm allowed to do that. Yes. I don't know if you know, but I'm allowed we're to all do that. Allowed. We can do it. So that is, there's a chest. Required a needle to go thread some clothes with. It's Porky McGorkins. Yes. Porky McGorkins. Okay, this we can wear gloves and gauntlets. That's interesting. Is there anything in this other direction here? Oh, there's a chest. We might want that. Oh no, there's kobolds. Kobolds? They're the furry kind. Furry kobolds? Yeah, there's like different kinds of kobolds. Like, Warcraft has its kobolds, which are like ugly, mangy, furry creatures. Indy has their yeah, see, lizard kobolds. The... Oh, it's great. These guys are like, more like cute dogs. I always think of the, like the D&D &D kobolds. Yeah. Kobolds. That's usually the first thing that comes to mind, like, but... Weird little dragon dudes. Yeah. This one has like a weird... Uh... Some things are a little bit different in this uh, universe. Oh my god. My leader can do a move with uh, an old guy with a stick. An old guy with a stick? Amazing. Yes. The old guy with a stick is named Kai. Let's go get his memory from our dad. Okay, we do the maneuver. Which involves hitting every kobold with a stick attack. Those poor kobolds. Yes. And we kill the last one via counterattack. We can fix the formation to put uh, our short range character in the front now. If that works. He was uh, he rather low level. We had to catch him up a little bit. Fortune rune. Oh, gonna increase my leader's luck. Did it. And we got some dudes. The free will attack. Is this always glitches? Is this the... Is this the that always glitches? Hmm? I think so. Glitches? One of these... Uh... So, one of the, like... Really long side missions... Like, it's a side mission that lasts pretty much through the entirety of the game. Um, In Mass Effect Andromeda? Yeah. Okay. Um, is you collect, um, they, they look like little, like, little, like, they kind, of, they kind of look like little stars that are, like, on the ground. You collect them, ah. um, and they unlock your dad's memories, Ooh. and there's one that, it's not this one. Okay, it's, we found Kobold Dog Village. And there's one that always and... glitches out. Ah. And where, like, 
I'm like, I as in like my character is supposed to be standing in the scene, yeah. and like all the, the other characters are talking well, to me as if I'm there, but you can't see me there. But my brother's there. Uh, so a so, thing just <laughs> happened. A thing. The very first kobold NPC that we found literally greets us with bow wow. Bow wow. But then bow, he wow, accuses wow. us of taking away his friends. He'd not forgive. And then we. <sighs> Okay. He also speaks in the third person when okay. he does say anything involving himself. Your mom is still alive. Apparently, the kobolds are sick. Something has happened to them. All right. Let's explore this village a bit here. There's nothing there. Nothing in the item shop. Literally nobody. Nobody at the end. Let's move on. Oh. Progress. Ah. And... Kobolds. The archer's in front for some baffling reason. And a mage jumps out at us to... Pound us on the head of his stick. We defeat them pretty easily, though. Slap them around. Yes. Oh yeah, our currency are bits. Swip boop. Stick attack. Not the stick attack! Yes. The stick attack. It is fantastic. The most awesomest attack that there ever was. Yeah, and pretty much. It will be again. I mean, I mean one, one of the people participating in this attack is the main character. And you know that it's gotta be a good attack if the main character is a part of it. And that one just that one kobold just fired shot fireball at my main character. Granted, it it didn't do very much damage, but it it was still a fireball. So yeah, we kind of need to take care of them quickly. Alright. Kobolds are dealt with. Does this unit have a soul? Maybe. Is, is that, sparked a three, that question sparked a 300 year war. The wizards succumb to super stick attack pretty easily. However, they cannot withstand the power of Axe Man and Punch Man combined. I was gonna say the booty, but. Also the booty, but mostly axes and fists. And we got one shield from one of them. And there is a funny tree. We found Elf Village. I think we might want to use this glowing orb here. For reasons. Up the tree ladder we go. person with a portrait. What? 
So, apparently the elves were super racist. Whoa. They didn't know humans could talk. What the fuck? Whoa. They think that we're all trying to exterminate them with tiny brains. Whoa. What the, what the fuck, elves? And this human that we ran into is trying to tell this elf village that some douche canoe is trying to... is playing something douche truly canoe. frightening. He's going to wipe the eyes out with a... by burning down this entire forest. Well, a forest that this person also happens to live in. So yeah, it's pretty bad business. And the elves are like, oh, humans are too stupid to think this could ha ever happen. Lock this one up. Wow. And so, that one gets locked up. Rough? Much? Yep. Like... Damn. It is. I was there. Okay, so the dwarves and the humans down south apparently want the elf land, according to one NPC. Boop, boop, boop. One person has realized the ruse. One person has realized the ruse. I have nothing to sell to humans, but the elf is okay. How will our armor look on humans? Uh, I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna buy most of this, honestly. I don't know. They have lucrously expensive robe. A necklace that nobody can use. And a, a feather? You a link. What? What? A link. A link? What Feathers. Is... That's what I want to know. Oh, it's right there. Boop. 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 And the shopkeep just tells us to beat it after we're done talking to <laughs> him. <laughs> okay. Who sent me that? Matt. <laughs> oh, God dang it, Matt. <laughs> Was it from Messenger? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. We elves will never lose, unlike those dirty dwarves and stupid kobolds. Hey, wow, these you're, elves you're gonna are fall racist. from grace eventually. I do not like these elves. Yeah, I do not. these elves I, are like, assholes. These motherfuckers are making like the drow like seem like you know golden. Nice. Yeah, and this one Good. is like the uh, those creatures up north called dwarves catch elves and eat them. Scary, huh? Maybe they were told horror stories about dwarves when they were younger, but little did they know it's just their xenophobia kicking in or something. This one. Uh, and this elf's like, this uh, human douche lives in a castle south of this woods. We'll get it next time. Well, if you're right, it will be quick. If my husband are around, we guardians of the forest would never lose. Let me guess, your <laughs> husband is not around. Your husband and therefore, is the Therefore, he will lose. I speak for the trees. And one person's like, oh, hey, elf person, you're back. Oh, what? Human friends? They're gonna help? Person who attaches and... Well, what do you want? What? This guy just told me, what do you want? <laughs> okay, I don't have any special runes for people right now. Dang it. 
Oh well. Well, there's only one place left to go in this forest. Village thing. Oh, right to, uh, the, uh, elf elders. Can you do me a favor? Huh. Can you get me some rock tail, please? Uh -huh. We meet another elf with a picture. This one must be important. And apparently it's somebody that, uh, our elf friend, uh, left alone for a while. Oh, hey, look. Their grandpa doesn't have a portrait. There's probably a reason for that. Their grandpa's racist, too. Yes. Everyone's racist. Okay, so our elf friend said they're humans, they're fighting the Empire. By the way, background to story, we're part of the Liberation Army now, at this point. Because, well, the Empire kind of set us up to, uh, be murdered or something because we knew a guy named Ted who the Empire wanted for some reason and because of this because we were friends with this Ted fellow we uh kinda got chased out of our home and land it, it's weird Gel's like what are you talking about we don't need a human help to protect our village Oh, those humans have been behaving themselves. Man, lock up these filthy ones that you brought into this village. Oh wait, the elf's being arrested too? Oh god. Well, we're in elf jail. Which is just the inside of a tree, apparently. And that's a fast elf. Yeah, I like the pork better. Well, there was there was just a lot. Like I don't. Maybe it was just I got like a bad a couple of pork rolls. That's a very fast, a fast elf. Oh God. This el this one elf's name is Stallion. He's very fast. Hmm. But a lot. Let's talk to this person here. Yeah, a lot of fat. Oh no, this person's wearing an imperial yeah, uniform. Uh oh, let me work on my mods. Different mods. Uh, thing is in stock. I'm... Quanda Rosman. That's a heck of a name for a person. He's a general. And he has a horrible weapon to exterminate the elves. <laughs> Our Scarface friend and slash servant asks, horrible weapon, what is it? The weapon's name is the Burning Mirror. What? A mirror? How's that gonna hurt? Oh, wait. Are the Empire going to exterminate the elves like ants? Is that how this is going to work? Oh god. This is terrible. What? what? Yeah, apparently the Empire has a thing called the Burning Mirror and they're going to use it to burn down the forest, I guess. Oh, shit. We hear a creak. And, oh, hey, look. It's the elf person that had a portrait that was not in our party Holy that came down that, here. That exists? Yes. Elves exist, Sarah. Jesus. Now, uh, dude over here is watching a stream a WoW screen where this guy's running Mob Souls Mythic level 16. Yep. 
It exists, apparently. I'm like, what the fuck? So, this elf asked, Why do you care about humans? They only die for like 50 years or so. And our uh, friend slash servant slash great party member, he's great, says one awful thing to say. And our elf friend is like, listen, yeah, it's true that humans made us like elves and dwarves. We also look down on humans and dwarves. And the dwarves hate us. It's sad. What's the difference? Why Everyone's can't we get along? Nobody. Why does everyone hate everybody? <laughs> yeah, he's like, why do we hate it? Why does everyone hate everyone? We don't understand. The elf that we're talking to apparently doesn't understand, but they can't trust pe humans and dwarves care of them. But, uh... But she'll believe the elf. She'll do her best to believe, and I'm hoping she breaks us out of this prison. Oh, oh yeah, okay, she does. She helps us break up, break out of this prison. And very fast elf decides to run. Our friend is impressed. <laughs> Means you gotta kill it. Means I gotta kill an arctic. Not the sex juice. Well, it looks like we're going to see the dwarves. Him. Let's hope they're not as racist. Yeah, let's hope not either. Yeah, let's go yeah. see the dwarves. <coughs> and I guess this uh, lady will also join us, maybe. Oh, there's, oh, there's some quests. Of oh no, I need Cora. And Elf is like, we should get rid of prejudices like that. Let's go, Master Xavius. Yes. We are called we are referred to as Master Xavius. Oh damn it, I need Cora. Hmm. Alright, it's time to do a sneak in. Oh. There is nobody in this uh elder's house right now. Let's sneak. By sneak, I mean bolt right the heck out of here, because this place is awful. And we're being joined by the uh, lady that was trying to tell the elves to stop being wankers and do something. Stop being wankers. I'm going to drop my fist user to incorporate her. And the elf that broke us out of prison is like, promise that you'll come back, other elf. He promises. And they kissed. Well then, let's proceed. Okay, she is short range. Good to know. Actually. Oh, she already has a shield. Never mind. Let's go. Oh god. Cobalts. This terminal right here? Yep. Two critical hits. Last rounds. Well, I thought that was another quest to pick up, but yes, there is. It's in northeast, I think. We're gonna go there. The architect quest. I should probably fucking fight it. Yeah, that's a good oh, idea. Oh, that's gonna be a bitch! Yes. There we go. <laughs> we obtained a lot of bits. And bitcoins. Bitcoin! And, oh, there's a very buff green dude. Have you seen the really buff cat? I've seen a cat that is... looks like a potato. This is, this is a really buff cat. Ah. Uh. Let me find a picture. Falcon Rune. Oh, 
Look at this ah. beefy boy. Actually, the uh, the lady that I just recruited is a very oh, beefy person. Girl. She's... Steroid cat. Oh god. Send the chat. He's beefy. Ah. Oh yeah, I should probably post that in the chat so that people know that this is happening. All right. I'm gonna post the First proceed <laughs> with the shenanigans. And oh, hey, look, a mountain pass. I bet dwarves live up there. Oh, it's literally called Dwarf Trail. Okay. And we cannot walk on the grass. Duly noted. Where? Look, Where? Look at this buff. Look at this, look at this fucking cat. Buff cat. Kevin, I'm fighting huh? an eagle man. Fight that eagle man. Slap him down. That's the plan. You don't get to fly no more, eagle man. You done. It's a very buff eagle man. I'm surprised he can even fly with all that armor. But, Bloss, we did beat him down. Where? Okay. We've acquired more feathers. <laughs> oh. Where's downloads? Documents? Arnold Schwartz or Cap? Arnold Katzenegger. Katzenegger. That what? boy is an absolute unit. The pee poop? It's boys. Do those go to? I'm gonna use deadly fingertips on one of these boars and see what happens. A veterinarian from New York called the cat an absolute Does unit. It go... No. Double muscle cows. Screen Double captured, but where does it go? I have no idea. Sarah, help me. What? I took. I took a picture. Uh, and wherever of... your screen caps end up. I don't know! I don't know either. Screenshots? No. Did you hit the print screen button? Yeah. It saved your clipboard. Paste it Where's... in like a image program or something. Where's my clipboard at? You just have to paste um, it somewhere. You know how you can copy and paste things? The thing that you copy things to is called a clipboard. Uh, Usually's... I don't know what you're talking about. Hmm. Not a clue. Okay. So... What do you mean copy and paste? Like, if I right-click? Yeah, if you right-click. That. Okay, it doesn't give me anything. Basically... If you need to be in, like, a, a Word document or something, you can paste it to. Nah. Word document, paint. Hmm. Anyway, we're finding dwarves now. So... I, I don't know. Clipboard? No, you just need to find something to paste it into. Okay. Yes, I do want to delete those. What the f The fuck? I don't have a... What do you mean, Word document? Like, where? That would be the fuck are you talking office. about? Hmm. Stop, and have to go back up. What are you talking about? Some, oh, that's just tools. Huh? Click on this! No, never mind. Then it's gotta oh, be down. Then, uh, I'm going to W, then I'm gonna have to do the W. Yeah, word. This shouldn't go to that. Like, it should I just. I don't know how to fix it. Paste. Nothing. No, because you're not. Click. Hmm. Okay, what are you trying to take a screenshot of? Um, a, my a picture in WoW, like the as I'm playing, and I has 
print screen and I can't it doesn't send it I don't know where it sends it hmm that's a really small cow because it doesn't send it to my pictures that's for fucking sure is there like a folder screen captured in like Balnet or something that sends pictures to no like in the program files or something no hmm progress. Those are birds. Oh. Right there. Yeah, but it's you not. found it. What? Nah. It's not there. Hmm. Yeah. Try it again. Check this one. Yep, it's in this one. Yeah, this is what it says. You press the Windows key, press the print screen button. If you press the Windows key and the print screen button, that's where they go. They go into your pictures. I found a sacrificial Buddha. No, but you have a quest for me, mainly. Meeba diva diva. Okay, I found it. I found it. Okay. Retro. Yes. Slap him, Viking man. Well, we're the ones on the lower right, so. I know, but Viking man looks cooler than everybody else. Yes. <laughs> yep. Anyway, in case you know, main character is Xavius. Who the hell is that old dude? Who the hell is that old dude? <laughs> Alright. Oldman is a guy named Kai. He apparently trained us when we were younger. And he is a random recruit that we can recruit in this game. We were small. I found a killer crystal. Well then. Well. Oh, oh god. Yeah. I actually let them go. Whoa! An option in this game, you can let enemies go if they seem like chumps. It's like an auto runaway or something. Ooh, the banner saga. Yeah, I heard it's not too bad. Alright. Climb I could up get this both one and two. Dangerous mountain. Alright. It's time to use the master pupil attack. Tumblestone. Treadnoughts. Strafe. Puzzle Firestorm again. Doctor Who. Live on Twitch. Woo. Cool. Oh no, right? Psychonaut. I say I know that sometimes Doctor Who is live and Sometimes it's just it's a couple of people that talk about like Doctor Who related things. That happens too. We obtained 3,500 bits. 
And no, not the Twitch bits. I can't get those. But it would be hilarious if I got that uh, status for Evan and Colin combined. What? Twitch if I bits? got if I got the affiliate thing or whatever That'd it is that Mike cool. got the other day. I'm gonna work on getting you some. Blue. If you had a subscribe thing, I was looking for it the other day. Yeah, say I cause... don't have one because I don't have the affiliate status. Yeah. I mean, I don't particularly care if I get that, but if I get it, it'd be hilarious and it'd be fine. I was like, I want to subscribe to his channel. Ah, uh, I mean, there's a follow button. That's about it yeah. so far. And honestly, that's probably the best way you can do this right now. Is it with, uh, yeah. Amazon Prime and like Twitch Prime yeah, or something you can like that. Yeah, Amazon to Twitch. Mm -hmm. You get a, a free subscription. Yep. Yes. I feel like I'm having a heart attack. You have any chest pains? Could be anxiety or stress related. Chest pains. No, no. Right here. How lucky is my main character? Let's find out. A little bit. Hmm. That's the only thing I know. I think you would know, Kevin. Man, I hit that thing two times. And it died. This is sad. I still have a bunch of shit to do on this planet. Oh boy. Ah, uh, which planet are you going to now? I'm on Eos. Ah. Eos. I forgot I just kind of left this planet behind because it was full of radiation and I couldn't go anywhere. Ah. Yeah, that kind of puts a damper on most uh Yeah, trips. because then I would just like die. Yeah. And death is not a good thing usually. However, Master People's Stick Attack is a good thing. Yeah. It's effective. There's a rock out there, there's a drone. Come back. Go wander out around here. And. You run into the kobold again. The one that said that all of the kobolds were sick. He tried to get the cure to the sickness from the elf, from the dwarves, but the dwarves are stingy. I don't forgive, but crew me busy now. He runs <laughs> off. And I have a feeling something terrible is going to come up because there's a glowing orb here. It's like it's like when you play the newer, like when you play video games and it's just like, oh, I'm running into lots of bad guys. I must be going the right way. <laughs> I mean, in this game, there's random encounters all over the place, so Whoa. maybe not so much, but that is generally the idea. Stronger enemies, progress. Bunch of eagle men and dwarves assault you, progress. Yeah, Character that I gave the fire magic rune to, using fire to burn up the dwarves progress oh and my axe man is kind of beaten up no but we slapped those dwarves up and we're, we're good axe man shall be fine do something axe man Gremio is his name and he is, he's very extra. Saving. Because I do not know what to expect.
saved. <clears throat> oh. This road is paved? I have no idea. I'm on this side over there, but we're gonna go hit this rock for science. Yes. For the sciences. Science. I'm gonna go find this rock for science. For science! Science! <laughs> for science! Those boars have some golden tusk. Tusks, excuse me. English. And oh, that's a pretty flashy fire spell. That. That. That was overkill. Fortunately, or unfortunately, I only have one of those. Wow, that was depressing. Thanks, Cora. Yes. Where am I going? Kobolds. This way. Oh, there's a remnant site right there. We can go check it out in a minute. Snowballed. We've arrived in Dwarf Village. Oh my, it's amazing for humans to get here safely. Okay. Are you going to sleep here? Don't break the bed. Well then. Well, dwarves are short. Like, if you look here, even the main character, who I, who is a kid, I think he's like in his teens or something, is taller than this dwarf. It's hard to tell, though. Yeah, sure, we can stay here. And we'll save for shenanigans. There's a quest over there. It's time to explore Dwarf Village. Oh, there's a windmill. And that's a dwarf kid. This windmill generates the power of thunder and light. Yeah, thunder and lightning. It's a dwarf secret teaching. Okay. Did you come here to learn from us like that blacksmith? Oh, hey, there's a blacksmith? Let's see him. Yo. So, Sarah, you know a little yes. bit of English. What's the plural of moose? Moose? Yes. Isn't it just moose? I don't know. But I found like a guy named... just changes? I found a guy named Meese. That's why I'm asking. I, I mean, I feel like that's a, a colloquialism. Yes. This guy's name is Meese. He wears green. We're recruiting him. I feel like it's a cool feeling. And I named my castle Trunk Ca <coughs> Trunk Castle because Xavius becomes a tree, if you'll remember your wow lore correctly. And True. what better way to represent a tree than a trunk? He does become a tree. He becomes a tree and then he becomes a thing again. Oh no, it's oh it's Snader. It's back to being a Snader. Schneider. I have rune fragments. I could use those on somebody. Alright. Water rune. What was that? That's weird. Hmm? It was the bear paw. It freaked me out for a little bit. Uh, I think I'll use this water rune on the uh, lady. I'm not leaving footprints in the sand. Even footprints in the sand. No, I'm not. I'm not leaving footprints. It's so weird. I'm going to get in the car. Two water rune fragments. Ah, ah, ah. Ah, ah, ah. Go, go in the water, please. Oh, get no, out of here. Shit. Be gone. Could upgrade my staff a little bit. Yeah. Oh, I can skin that. Oh, that's right. I don't have to go around the other way for this. Yeah, I do. Wieners! 
<sighs> okay. So, my elf's bow changes. When you upgrade a weapon in this game, you don't actually buy new weapons, you just upgrade the ones that you have. When you upgrade them to a certain point, their name changes. So, our elf used to have something called the light bow. Now it's called the shine bow because we improved it enough. How? How the balls? I don't know. It's an anomaly. There's a, a question. It's a feral worgen. How feral? Super feral. I only wear a lane cloth feral. Yes. <clears throat> That's how feral. Alright, everyone's weapons improved to level 7 or better. I think we're good. At least for a little while. Okay, now how the hell... You must have to go up that way. Nope, no, 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 wait. Oh. This dwarf kid is so innocent. He he asks us if we're one of those so-called humans. It is down there. And somebody that can identify mysterious items. Unfortunately, we don't have any mysterious items, so that doesn't matter to us. Oh, but there are dwarf God. children here. Oh, got my camera freaking out. This guy's gonna be strong enough to beat both elves and humans. Okay. This guy's gonna study hard and be smarter than elves or humans. And this guy's like, yeah, we hate the elves, and the elves look down on us. It's always been that way. No one even remembers the original reason for this hatred. We don't remember why we hate each other, but, but we just hate each other. But we just. I mean, the elves are super racist, and the dwarves are like, I don't know, practical, but still racist. And, okay, this dwarf has been doing research on runes, and it contained the elemental powers of the world. Yeah, that, that makes sense, given the lore of this game. Okay. <laughs> Alright, this guy. Apparently, an Imperial General named Quanda is attacking the village of the elves. This dwarf really couldn't care less. They're always making fun of us anyway. Okay. This guy has us if we've been sharpening our weapons. Wait, we just sharpened them, man. Relax. Calm the down! Relax. The very Your sharp weapons. weapons. Are good. Heck, my sp my staff can cut you. Heck. They're heckin' sharp. Yes. I am an ultimate. And this dwarf looks fancily dressed. He's probably important. Yeah, let, he let is important. He has a portrait. Let me up there. <laughs> this dwarf's like, that's unusual. Human and elf hand in hand. What brings you to the dwarf mines? The elf speaks and asks for a favor. Too bad. And the dwarf's like, a proud elf asking a lowly dwarf for a favor. <gasps> and the lady friend that we recruited asked the chief if they've heard of a burning mirror. And the dwarf's like, of course I have, it's one of our treasures. And our lady friend's like, okay, so this Imperial General got a hold of the blueprint and is planning to burn down the forest. The dwarf does not believe them. Or says, that's funny, I hope all the elves are killed. Wow. The elf's like, what a thing to say. Wow. And, yeah, the dwarf does not believe us, because do you expect me to believe that one of you sluggish humans succeed in stealing this blueprint from us? Fellow Cage stole the blueprint. 
And the dwarf asks us to prove our competence. Try it by breaking into our vault. Okay, sure. If you want us to steal from you, that's fine. I mean, your boss. Yes. Our vault is north of this village. It's too big to it was too big to build here, so we built it elsewhere. Okay. <laughs> well, it looks like we're gonna do a heist. One sanctioned by the dwarves, no less. It's dwarf heist time. Dwarf heist is now a thing. Sure. All right. And that looks like a vault. This guy's like, oh yeah, the chief t told us that you guys were coming. Go ahead and try breaking in. Okay. Well, it's easy so far. We're just going down some stairs. And that's where the thing happens. There's death machines and crimson dwarves. Okay. Killed a death machine. Yay. My axe man quickly strikes a dwarf in the face. Try and take over the world. Strike. One of my guys has 666 experience. <laughs> Actually, who is that? Oh, my Axe Man has 666 experience. Well, Axe Man. And we have levers. Go. Lefty left. Up that up. Okay. That's how we get the chest. Yeah. Oh, I got that on the first try. I'm surprised. Well, we solved one puzzle. You gotta be way up there. Get that shit out of y'all. You can believe in human tenacity and... Holy shit, that's a lot of death machines and dwarves. Okay. Death machine. We kinda need to put this into overdrive. Maximum overdrive? Yes. The maximum overdrive. Oh, wait. I just quoted Elsonic. Never mind! Is that... Master people stick attack. Save me. Fire save me. Save me. Burn them to a fine crisp. Mm. And that was effective. Axeman still has 666 experience. Wow. Well, he gained a level, but still. Ah. Oh god. Slash has taken over. What up? Hi, Cadell. Uh, Welcome to the stream. I'm just hopping on before I head to work for an hour. I uh, see. Yeah. Uh, what stream is this? I am streaming Suikoden, a game for PlayStation 1 that is a RPG that is kind of crazy. Nice. Lots of racist elves and dwarves. And yes. Shit, yeah. Hopefully <laughs> everyone will come together and stop being racist. In total fairness, there's not. I've never really. I've, they have a history for being racist, both groups. That's true. That's true. Towards the other, ironically. Yeah. <laughs> I say they've been racist towards each other and the humans, and humans. Some humans have been racist against them, and it's a well, whole weird circle of racism that. I, I'm. Oh, that's the I, exit. I should probably find the other item in this maze.
Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm quite familiar with human racism. I understand uh, that much. Yeah. But, uh... <laughs> yeah. But, uh... Yeah, you know, the dwarven one and the elven one really weird for me. Yeah. <laughs> it's saying, currently, it's weird because the dwarves are like, oh, humans are too sluggish to break into our vault. Here, try breaking in. And they break in. We are breaking in right now. Nice. And they break. Well, we are going through the maze full of death machines oh. and crimson colored dwarves. And I found a magic robe in here. There, Somebody's gonna wear that. that. Nice. That? What the hell is that? A cat face. I'm gonna kill it. Kill it. Oh no, I didn't want to get out of the car. <laughs> I'm gonna kill it if I could get back in the car. Oh, oh no 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 no! Don't go that way, God, please. I can't fly. Professions. Drive right over that fucking rock. Back in the car. Okay, my X Man no longer has the devil's experience. We're good. Satan will not possess him today. <laughs> However, the people of Styx will dominate. Off a cliff. Fire at will. Well, don't do that. You, no, you, that's, you have so much to look forward to, Sarah. You don't drive off a cliff. But I don't no. take fall damage. Come well, that, that changes everything. Yeah, right? Well, You're thinking a game like that, though, that they would have like fall damage be a thing. Nope. Whoa. Apparently not. And so is this one of those weird ones where I get that, uh... Alright, we've gotten through the maze of death, machine. I must ascend- Descend the stairs of death, machine. And that was a critical hit on a machine. That was electrifying. Because the main character, I gave him a thunder augment to his staff. Don't know if that's the smartest move, but it. Don't stand in the scourge. I don't plan on it. And moving platforms. What the heck? Well, there's a chest. Oh, hey, another Thunder Rune piece. Cool. Thunder. I mean, I mean, look at those cat <laughs> so Cordell, I got a I got a new D and D book full of scary things. Oh, where? Yeah. Cool. Mordenkainen's Tome of Foes. 
That is pretty scary sounding on its own. It's pretty fucking awesome. With the substance within, kind of can elaborate more on this. It's got like lore between like the uh, the uh, the blood war, which is the eternal war between demons and devils. Um, gives you like stats and everything for like the arch dukes or the arch devils and the the main demon, like the demon lords, like Cambians. Um, gives like. Uh, what is it? Uh, where is it? Tiefling sub-races. So, like, you could be, like, related to a specific devil. Um, uh, where's Still the ranks. other one? Oh. Like, st stuff on to create, like, demonic cults and shit. All the stuff on, like, the elves, like, how the drow and stuff came to be, and, like, aging and death, the elven outlook, like, the look inside their mentality, because, you know, they're supposed to be, like, this alien kind of, like, because they live, like, hundreds of years. Something like that would not have, like, the typical like mentality as like a human would because they live so long and i and i found out something else that sometimes was it takes them a while to mature i'm assuming and other oh, various like things elves no elves are like bam like they're there they look at humans and, and it's like you're a small little childlike race that's cute pinch cheek pinch cheek yes that's but, uh, a very different type of elf from the elves in this game. <laughs> I can imagine. We were like, everyone is... All the elf humans are Those stupid. Wow. Well, yeah, they think that too. Yes. The, yeah. They live, they live so long. Like, how could you not be like, well, you're dumb. Because you know nothing. You know I also nothing found out know. that when elves go into their little trance thing, that they, uh... They can relive any memory, like, on a whim. Like, all they have to do is think about it, and they can relive it in detail. Wow. The only elves that can't do that are the drow. Yeah. And also, when elves die, they don't necessarily die. Corell and Lorithian reincarnates them. Hmm. And once again, the only elves that that doesn't happen to is it's the drow. Because they're kind of not uh, in good they're relations cut with off. that guy. They're cut off from yeah, all of things, like anymore. all the things of Corellin and yeah, all the other they, elven they pantheon. That also kind of reminds me of uh, Starcraft's Protoss, actually, a little bit, because there. there's like the Kali, and then the Dark Templar are cut off from that. Caldream are also kind of cut off from that for a different reason, and yeah. Um, also found out that, uh, what's it called, that, the, that Corellin... Oh, hell, second viewer. Corellin and, um... Look. Um... Loth. Yeah. Used to be... But now he's in a thing, he's kind of in a thing with Sahini, though. Now. I mean, Loth did kind of... Fiddle dee, diddle dee, piddle dee, do. What? Okay, they used to be lovers. This is a riddle? Sure. Oh god, fiddle dee, diddle dee, piddle dee do. Yeah, oh. This thing looks like a screaming face if you zoom out of the map and look at this. My god. Okay, let's figure out how to do this. Metal. D. Okay, that didn't seem to be it. Middle. D. 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 Okay, that wasn't it either. Middle. D. 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 The hell kind of riddle? 
Yeah. Okay. Okay, that opened the door. Riddle solved. There's hallways. And machines. Auction, auction, auction. I can technically let them all go, but I'm gonna fight them all because I can. Yeah. And also, it gives me money. Yeah. Stick Attack of Doom is here. Oh, hello, third yeah. viewer. Ah. <laughs> Yay. Welcome to the stream of Suikoden, the, the first one. And then apparently, like, the Raven Queen. We're currently is... proving that humans are not so sluggish after all. And there's a bag of medicine. I kind of landed my car on it. That was a fucking Chilerian. Like shadow elves. Ah. Get out of here, Chilerian. Oh, also, this is a of also, the stream is a discussion between various types, various races, ranging from oh, Mass oh. Effect ones to D and D ones to the ones in this game. Various mm -hmm. video games. Yes. I really like the Eladrin. Yeah, they're super cool. They're hella cool. Indeed. Seals. We get it. You live in the sea. <laughs> we get it. You like you like Aquaman. <laughs> Do you believe that Aquaman is superior to Superman all the time? Technically, technically Aquaman can beat Superman pretty easily if he tried hard enough, but that's no, besides the point. Yeah. Superman needs to breathe and Aquaman can just cover himself in water so he can fly. Just flood everything. Uh, I think those uh, stairs are progress. Both those stairs are probably progress. Oh god. Get that robot. It's got weird legs. It looks like Metal Gear. Metal Gear! <laughs> Snake! A colonel. A colonel! I thought these dwarves were good guys! A colonel! Why no, is everyone Snake! So They're racist? not good guys. They're crimson dwarves for a reason. No, Snake. They're just a computer program. Like you. You're in a video game, Snake. Everyone's a video game. You're being controlled by someone right now. And those people, they're in video games. And they're being controlled by other people. But, Colonel, I'm actually riding. <laughs> oh, God. You're also actually a lady. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> no, not again. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I was fighting Senator Armstrong right now. And we're fighting boars in the Dwarven Vaults. They let they let boars run wild in here. Yeah, no wonder a human broke in here and got stole blueprints for a burning mirror that burned down the elf forest. You're just a clone of Big Boss. Don't worry. But Colonel... Okay, that was weird. That was weird. I went in a circle. Okay. Stick attack. Kill. Super stab that death machine. Throw your air moon sword, I guess. And shoot an arrow. No, shoot get away from me! Arrow. It's definitely Metal Gear. You're fighting Metal Gear. Metal Gear. I'm, I'm convinced it's Metal Gear. No, Which one? Rex, Ray, Excelsius? What was the one that ha had the weird legs? I think all of them kind of had weird re legs, but if it's the one from Ugly Solid 1 or 2, one is Rex so, and no. two is Ray. Nah. It's not them. It's kind of like the ones that they had in, uh... Oh... I can't even remember it. It was... it's for the newer stuff. Hmm. It's the one where you found out that Big Boss was alive. Wait. Um, would that be the... This is the one where you had to... 
Oh, for God. PlayStation what? 4? No, 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 no. That was in like uh, three. That was on the PS3. PS3. Yeah, where else? Um, that's a Shadow Hog. That's not even a Metal Gear, but no, it it's is a still... Metal Gear. It was like five or something. Oh, and five. Yeah, I forgot that one was called. I know it had <laughs> yeah, a weird. Found it was out he was a clone. Super tall. Yeah. And... yeah, that same one. I I'm fighting so. against a yeah, guy yeah. whose no, whose no. torso is also a guy. Yeah, was that the Phantom Pain? I haven't played a single uh, Metal Gear game. I oh think. God, are they good? Like I know they're like stealth games. The first stealth games have never been my thing. Same. But like the one game stealth game that I really tried to get into, but was just like crazy hard for me, was a uh, Dishonored. Yeah. Uh, I say yeah, I it's, I no, it's it was a very Metal good Gear game. Solid Four. Ah, Four. Is the one I'm thinking about. Mm. I know that both Rex and Ray appear in that one. There was Arsenal Gear. Yeah, or Guns and Outer Hershey. Haven, I guess. That was a thing. They had the weird leggy like Wait, who was like no, there's this oh, one the villain. Right nah, there's this one villain from Metal Gear that apparently was kinda cool. I don't know, he was like a the, bunch, man. Was like he was cute. like this cowboy type dude. Like he carried a revolver, revolver. ocelot. That's a revolver ocelot. Revolver yeah. ocelot, yeah. Yeah, he permeates the entire cool. series. He's, huh? he's, he's cool. great. Yeah, you, like, I love when you first meet him in, uh, what is it, Snake Eater. Snake Eater! That one is so fucking cool. Like, he's young and, like, cocky as shit and tries yes. to... He gets fucked up by the big boss. Like, yeah, he, he tries to, like, do some crazy shit and... Because he's all about, like, hand tricks and twirl tricks with his gun and being, like, super flashy and shit. He got his, and uh, beliefs from He Western tries movies. to do that shit to Big Boss, and you're, like, you know, CQB, and you just wreck mm. his face. CQC. He just, like, fucking takes his fucking shit from him and just, like, beats his ass, and he's like, that's... Your, your whole technique is, like, is dumb. Like, in close quarters, you're, like, s super invalid, you know? stuff like that he's like really young too yes that's also where we meet um the boss yep Little the guy. boss you meet the boss um ava shit there's so many like weird villains in that too like that what was adam it? was a dude no adam couldn't make it i'm ava okay Ah, uh, shit, there's like so many different things. I killed all of them, they didn't even know yes. I was here. This guy that I'm fighting has... He has a... He looks normally human up, from the torso up, but his legs are another torso. That's just upside down. It, my, it, it's, it's throwing me off. My favorite villain out of like, the series, like all the Metal Gears, was... Well, I like Psycho Mantis. He was crazy. That that freaked me out like super bad. Set man. Do you remember him? Again, I didn't play a Metal Gear. Oh so shit, Solid. my bad. But uh, he Wait, would that like. Was one that I did play. Um. It was Metal Gear Solid Two. It was for PlayStation. No, nah, no, nah, this one was uh different. I'm trying to remember. Psycho um, Mantis is PS One. No, it was a yeah. uh, not with a uh, raid. Oh, Metal Gear Rising oh, Revengeance. Like, yeah, Back, yeah. You know, he's great. He was in two of them. He was in. He, actually, he technically, he was in the second one as playable character. Yeah. He appeared in the fourth one, and he was in MGR. He was a nugget. Yes. He was a I nugget. I mean, they did better with him in MGR, but then again, you also get to hear it's Jack the Ripper. Oh God. No, he like he had this mechanic in his in the thing. Where like you had to uh, you had to plug in another controller because he would he would like read he'd be like I know your every move Snake you can't outdo me stuff like that yeah. and you would have to like you would have to plug in because he would read ev your controller he's like I can read your controller oh that's stuff like that and I was like what I know what's on your memory yeah. card you played yeah. Suikoden didn't you oh that's yeah. hilarious <laughs> you enjoy Castlevania he would read it would read data from like your memory card and be like what 
Undertale kind but you, of. But if you plugged in that. a second controller, that was the only way you could beat him. Mm. Oh, that's. It's almost worth it, honestly. I say it's it's crazy. a. The series in general seem is pretty good, but it can be kind of hard to get used to if you're not familiar with it initially or something. But it, it's fine. It does its job pretty well. And That's then, good. who is it? Well, uh, the cyborg ninja. Fox, yeah. wasn't it? Gray Fox. Wasn't his name? Gray Fox. Yeah. Is, yeah, in the first one. Is the cyborg ninja? He was a badass. Indeed. <laughs> and then you had like, uh, what was it for? From Sons of Liberty, I think. Yeah, the second one. Was, yeah, where it with uh, Vamp. Yeah, Vamp is. I love Vamp. Vamp was the shit. I say so there's like, like a secret codec call in that game where I don't know if it's a secret or if it just happened in the story. You figure out why Vamp is named Vamp. Yeah. Vampire. No, I'm no, so it's cool. because he's. That's what they call bisexuals. Yeah, it's like a what? slang word for bisexual people. Oh, that's. Mm. Well, that's but he was odd. He was fucking. He only used blades. Yes. Like, he liked. And uh, he was yes. super fast. Like, like we're talking Albert Wesker fast. Yes. And he, uh... He also had, like, regenerative powers, like... You fight him, yeah, you fight him in, like, this one scene, you, you're fighting him and shit, and you fucking shoot him right between the eyes. You fucking dome piece him. And, nice. like... In a cutscene, The too. next scene, the next scene, like, you're out in this fucking aircraft, and all of a sudden you see somebody running across the top of the water. And then oh. straight up the side of a building, and it goes like closer in to like the person running across the water, and it's Vamp with a bullet hole in his head, like smiling at you, like he runs up to the plane that you're flying in. That don't make like, sense. It's a fun fact: you. the uh, scar from the bullet hole remains even yep. in the fourth game. Yep. Yeah, like in the fourth game, you find out he's got like some fucking like nanite technology shit. Now, machine that, like, son. Yeah, keep, like, regenerate him. And him and Raiden, like, cut each other up. Oh, that fight was... Ah, oh, so yes. good. That fight was so good. I was just like, oh my god, these guys are gonna get sue the fuck out of each other. And nobody's gonna win. Like, they're just gonna die. <laughs> I'm gonna escape the dungeon. Because I got the plot item. The one that the dwarf told me, hey, you can't steal this. Well, guess what? We stole it. And we're going to throw it in your face. The fucking ending. I'll never forget the ending of of um, Sons of Liberty. Yes, that was a where like and a half. you defeat what is it? Solidus. Solidus. Yeah. Another Solidus clone of Snake. Big Boss, except he yep. was older and actually it was a perfect clone or something. Yeah. But he like you you beat the game right. And all of a sudden, like, he goes, like, you get a call on your comms that you have from, uh, the colonel. And he starts saying, like, what if I told you that this is just a video game? What if I told you you're just being controlled? What if I told you that life, like, as you're playing this video game, you, the player, are simply a video game? Being controlled by some other that external was, force. That's, like, fucking, I don't know if anybody played Bioshock. Yeah. Yeah. The yeah. fucking first Bioshock, oh my god, that fucked me up so bad when Andrew Ryan was just like, he he showed you that you were being controlled by literally three words. Oh. So we convinced the dwarves to help us and get over their racism. And it was really funny. So um, that's good. In my field placement this past year, my film instructor, Diane, her <laughs> husband, um, played like plays lots of video games. It's and time to make progress. And go and back she home. watched him play Bioshock, and so Virginia she would do that to us. Say, would you kindly? And then I would just give her a look, like, really, Diane? Really? No, like I was, I was like, I was. It was what? I don't remember when that game came out, but I was young. Old indeed. And I was, I was fucking, I was on some shit, and we just got done beating this game, and I was, I was pretty stoned, and. All of a sudden, like, this comes on, you know, and we're just sitting there, me and my friend are sitting there, like, watching this, like, looking at each other, like, the fuck is he saying? Like, 
just you know paranoia kicks in and you're just like ah uh, i can't handle this right now man <laughs> Then you start questioning, like, you know, reality and everything, and... Yep. We had to, like, it just kept going. I remember, like, it, it just kept going. Like, the fucking, uh, general wouldn't stop. He just um... would not stop talking about it and going on. He was like, all your world is constructed. Like, it's just programmed. Uh, it's not real. A terrible thing has happened. I don't okay. know. The environment uh... that I just fixed. The forest is on fire. The forest is on fire? Already. What the hell happened? Oh no! Get out of the way, random encounters! We need to get back ASAP! Who burnt the forest? The Who's guys that have the, the burning mirror, I'm guessing. Get out of the way, dwarves! What the is shit? What we want? Ah! Is it the elves? The elves are the ones that live in that forest. Oh. Somebody's sabotaging. Ah. Uh, stop getting, getting in the way, hatreds. random wild dwarves that don't know that the dwarves made peace of us, maybe. Okay, the boars are in the way now. Right, get out of the way. Get out of the way. Get the yeah, fuck out of the way. The get out of the way. Get down! Get out of the Get way, down. kobolds! Someone's trying to cure your people. Do it! Get out now! Get okay. The that tree is burnt. Oh no! The dwarf, the elf village has been burned. Whee. Oh, there's a nullifier in there. Wee! I got wings. It's and awful. Shit. It's horrible. It's horrible. Oh my god. Our efforts were in vain. That's so horrendous. Shit. That was an assembler. The elf is depressed now. Fuck that. would be too. Burnt down his home. He was insulted and abused. He fought on, and yet. And yet. Oh, you killed him. Good job. Nothing you remains. Died. He tried to protect everything, but everything fell apart. Sounds like he, he planned to give that you. ring to the elf that we met that had a portrait that didn't run really fast. The one that well, broke us out. Well, woulda, coulda, shoulda, but didn't. Uh, now you did. There's oh, nothing. God, I gotta reload. There's nothing. And our axe no. man picks up that ring. He's going to give it axe to. Man. He's going to give it to our elf man. Na, 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 na. Axe Man. Axe Man tells us with just a little bit of hope you can survive, live on. That goes for humans as well as elves. Young Master, let's return to the castle. We must never let this tragedy repeat itself. Let's no, defeat that Kwanda fella and destroy that burning mirror. Never That's our only deliverance. Never gonna let you down. Never gonna turn around. Desert you. Oh, I'm sorry. It is okay. Rick rolling on the on the stream. Whoa. Rick rolling. Triangulation achieved. Let's go back to. Oh, there's a dude here. Why is there a dude in the burnt village? You okay, this guy's like, okay, this is terrible. This is, I wish they wouldn't do that. Now I have to change the maps. Wait, what? Right here. Maps? Because what? I might die. Why? What you talking about? He wants to join us. He's an expert map maker. Oh. Yeah, cool. sure. Join us. <laughs> join us. He's going for Trunk Castle. One of us. One of us. And he's giving us a map. This is gonna suck. Begin a map of the hey, game. Hey, Kevin. Hey, Snare. Look at this. Ah! Uh, looks like a big old mechano penis at first. Oh, God. That sounds scary. It's gonna take me at least 20 minutes and a lot of yelling to fight it. Young. This bitch. Oh, Alright. Fucking come at me. 
Come at me, you bitch. All right, so. Oh no, no, do, do not do. Oh god. So we have a map of the uh, area I... now, so we can uh, figure uh, out where we're going. I think. Yeah. I hope that's the intent. And there oh, is a yeah. castle here. Uh, oh no, Gertog. Blood boil is dead. Oh man. Well. I killed him! You're that fugitive! Run away! Oh, I am running. Run uh, away! You I'm a die. fugitive, so uh, no, let, let's I, not stay there. It's a pain in the dick. I made nullifiers. Man. Who are assholes. Better get good. See if begin to run off. Yeah. Better get I'm good. Not afraid to run away. Kind of have not to run away from that castle. To run away. Yes. We're bravely running away, away. <laughs> Oh god. The brave Sir Robin. Now cut out. Yes. Bravely ran away. Bravely ran away. I should name my character Robin. Oh well. It's too late now. It's too late for regrets. We're in the great uh, oh, too too late late forest late village they and know. we're too late. Okay. Kobold oh, we run to the kobold again. Curl Mimi says we cannot oh, Curl Mimi cannot cot here. Must help everyone. And oh no, it's oh, Imperials surrounding us. Damn Imperials! Oh, I blew up in my. Oh, I just got hit by a bunch of grenades. Oh no! Oh, We're surrounded. It's dangerous. That's shooting at yeah, me. you get back in there. And I was like, "What are you talking yeah, about? This is extremely up. dangerous." It and lady offers to turn herself in. Why? Wait, you swear to God that you won't hurt us? She don't hurt you. Ow. Okay, Let me I'll guess, see. you don't actually believe in a god, and you're going to hurt us anyway. That is always a possibility. Yes. Then... That is a strong possibility. Well, or honestly... believes in a god of hurting. <laughs> see, I'm a man who believes in verbal loop. <laughs> Stop it, Valeria. Don't turn yourself in. Get out of here, three-faced thing. Dang it, she left Ow. the party. No. Men Why? killed the elf kobold and the rest of the traitors. Wait, what? He got its legs. Ah. Ow, ow, ow. And, okay. The guy's like, God, there's no God in these modern times. Wow. Dang it. Okay. Kobold is fighting. No one can die now. Yeah, the kobold bitch. joins our party. Let's get this party started. Unfortunately, the kobold's in the back of the party, is holding a sword, probably can't reach anyone, so... Kobold should get good. Yes. Well, he will get good. Where are you going? I think. He will get... get good. Okay, fire get person can just light all these soldiers on fire. Oh, he can use medicine. Good. He can serve a purpose. Pop down the barricade and... The soldiers are veterans. I don't know if that matters, because they're all they all roast the same in the end. Get out of here, ghost. Fuck off, ghost. Fuck off, ghost. Oh you're behind we me. We win winner. Winner. Wait, winner. how are we losing? We killed all those Chicken. guys. Dinner. Curl Mimi, no give up. Oh. Kobold says. And the rest of our army shows up. Yes. Sir, uh, oh, some of the fellows right Liberation Army arrived. And the Imperial soldiers suddenly retreat. We are saved by our own men. Boop beep, boop beep. beep. I keep hearing that robot. Yeah, Bastion. And apparently, the elves that we that have portraits that broke the one that broke us out and the one that oh, ran fuck. really fast both escaped the elf village before it got burned down. Oh no, you don't! Oh god! And. 
the elves went to inform our army about the burning mirror, and they are here now. And we're going to go kick the enemy's ass, I hope. Yeah. Can I please destroy your friends? Oh, let's just set this on auto run. And our two friends, Humphrey and Sanchez, arrive with Humphrey. survivors. Humphrey. Humphrey and Sanchez. Humphrey. Sanchez Humphrey. is a great name. Humphrey. And Humphrey. Humphrey. All right. And there's a third one. Well, we Humphrey. might as well uh, get started with troops being forward. I don't know what this means. Let's find out. Oh no, that hurts. That um, hurts. That hurts. That that's a splash screen. I'm concerned now. Nope. Nope. This is a little nope. bit different. What? What? I'm in Illidan's whorehouse. Shit. That's nice to know. I'm in a weird does scenario that I've not seen know? this game yet. Does it involve a whorehouse? Um, not quite, but involves a harem? It involves a different type of strategy. I I don't know. There's a lot of little guys on the left side. I'm assuming that's the enemy. That is the enemy. That is, that is Imperial Army, and we have, time to we have a bunch of little dudes on the right side. Slap them. We're gonna slap their putty. That's the best thing slap you can do. Slap putty. That's what I'm trying to do. Is slap okay. this motherfucker Charge, in the putty. Charge, bow, magic, others. What are the others? Make the enemy turn traitor. Check enemy strategy. Oh, Fill some times. Charge check power. Okay. Well, we're gonna see if we can make anyone turn traitor. Oh, you're shooting at me. That's nice. What up, Mother Shiraz? How do you like the stockpile? Go, Chandler. Uh huh. Slap you leg. down. Forgive us, we have failed. Really? Oh, I'm running out of ammunition. Okay. Thieves, check their strategy. Oh, that's I don't a like lot that of... guy. He's creepy. Creepy guy. The enemy's next oh, plan no, is no. Quanda's a. Ow. What? What kind of name is Quanda's attack? Quanda's Why? attack. Uh, I'm box. assuming that means magic. Sure. I have a mage. Let's do this. Lux. This mage's name is Luke. Oh, fuck hmm. balls. And we just oh, annihilate half of their army. Me. That mage's name is Fuckboss. <laughs> Thief, steal some shit from them. Welcome to Sarah's profanity hour as steal she their, plays uh, video games strategy. and viciously as I get swears at up. it. Oh. Viciously swears at it. Okay, so this guy thinks the next plan is bow attack. <laughs> Let's go. Thanks. What that means is that. Oh, so my head? strategy can boost charge attack power. <laughs> We're gonna do that. <laughs> my strategy just said, Shoot it. see Shoot the it. power Shoot. of the science. Shoot. That's a good thing to do. That's, that's a great name. Great quote. Ooh, just angry. wrecked your faces. Commander's team, wreck their shit. Oh, some of them died before my men even got there. Well, then. Damn. Punch it, Jaw. Uh, well, we destroyed the remainder of their army. Come on, Akama. You stupid fool. Well, that that's great for my first time doing this particular weird battle mode. It's weird that Ka Akama uses commas. Like a ah. weapon. Oh no, they're using the <laughs> burning <Akama>. mirror. <laughs> Like Scythe, comma thing? Yeah. Uh, comma. <laughs> Alright, guys. <laughs> I'll see you guys later. I'm gonna head to work. See you, Alrighty, man. man. Bye. Have a good night at work. Thanks. Have a good okay. night, man. I'll see you guys around. Later. Later. Oh, those are grenades. Oh, no. He's gonna attempt to burn us with a mirror. Open the door, comma. Disperse. Disperse, ye. Drow Adventurer Story Shit. Hooks. Take that! Oh, and that mirror just shattered. Yay. Come on. Hey, the dwarf came through for us. I was like, that's what you get for stealing. Even though we let this party I'm steal from us on purpose. We got here in time, elf. 
and one of our uh, other regulars, a guy named Victor, is like, let's go storm this castle and take uh, Kwanda's head. He really doesn't like me right now. Alright, our party for this is determined already. I'm assuming this means we need to rearrange things. Formation. Yep, we need to rearrange things. There's not, there's not Victor, there's dog there. man, and uh, awesome right here, woman. Right You're up front. Everyone else, go to the rear. I'm gonna stand over here, and please do not fire your stupid shit at me. Dad, what up? So you got your skull thing there. That's nice. I said don't fire your stupid shit at me, you asshole! Too bad! That's unfortunate. <clears throat> it fucks my shields up. Yes. Damn, calm down. This is an intense fight, Kevin. Hi, Ella Dad. I'm gonna go this back this way. You hug Illidan like Storm Rage. Ammunition. Is there anything in this door? Shall we rest? Uh, yeah, sure. You rest blow us. a kiss at Illidan Storm Rage. Don't okay. hurt me, Daddy. We're resting. I love you. Let's proceed with shenanigans. Guys. No, we'll hey, how how can... Dogman can attack now. Oh, oh fucked up your leg. Okay, now get mad again. Oh, they get to move first. Or earlier than my main character does. <laughs> my main character's fast. Back up here, big boy. They've been decimated. Oh, shit. Anything else? Oh, there's a chest there. Oh, the thunder in peace. Cool. How come I don't get hoof feet? I don't know. Do you want hoof feet? Ooh, yeah, I want hurt. hoof feet. Okay, well, I pissed it off enough. Boo! My ass, boo! Oh, fuck! No shit, that was close! Oh, yeah, fuck yeah, it was. You almost died there. Hey, you better run. You better run. Oh, shit! Oh, shit! Oh, God. Oh, damn! Keep <laughs> moving. Oh, there. This is a very mobile fight. Yeah, I see. Oh god. Cannot stand in one place. Fuck you. The bulwark oh. of Azanoth? Fuck off. And the kobold gets a critical hit. Oh, balls. Meanwhile, Ow. Victor catches up in levels. <gasps> oh my god, I got a Warglaive! Holy shit! Oh my god! Oh, I, I just got one of the Warglaives of Azanoth. I pissed it off enough that it's just gonna send friends at me now. This is not a good place to stand. I will be taking that. Thank you, Dad. Thanks, Dad. You're welcome, son. That's the shit. Um, we need to go home now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thank you. 
Sorry, a lot of equipment arranging here. Oh, you got your leg. Oh no, I want to destroy your head. Oh, Come on. Hand one. I need the main. Let me in there. Oh. I'm gonna do this shit again. Oh, that is put on some personal cover. Fucking... Old book volume one has been found. Ha ha! Well then. Fuck, I hate these things. Uh. There's one on every major planet. Uh. That yeah. was only the first one. There's one on every planet. Well, damn. Except Havaro. There's not one on Havaro. Every planet where you place an outpost, there is one. I think. They suck. Whoop. Yeah. Yes, they do. I hope it's like the enemies minutes. suck too. Right? They suck. You get sick. Ah. Yes, we are making the Empire look like wimps. Aha. Uh -huh. Punch the air, you idiot. Okay. That troll guy is still there. <laughs> oh my god. He's still there fishing. Oh. Wow. That poor guy. That, was a that poor guy. I call will dodge a blow pretty quickly. Nice. Yay. It prevented him from dying. Why is that light still on? I don't know. A slice of bacon. Okay, the elf now has the devil's experience. I acquired half armor. I don't know what that means. Only half armor? Half armor is a thing. <laughs> Can he equip. Okay, the kobold cannot equip half armor. He Shall needs turn. whole armor. Don't Nobody can equip yet. half armor. Got it. What the fuck is this? Devil shield? Uh, okay. That's kind of weird. Maybe I should make one of them disappear. That'll work. It worked. Overkill. Never been so good.
Devil Shields again. Make another one disappear. And thou can breathe on us, I guess. Okay. Devil Shield has been defeated. They're actually kind of scary. And suddenly, dragons. God. Dragons. And it looks like it has lightning coming off of it. Time to fight me a dragon. And it shocked the crap out of my kobold. Hello. I'm fighting an electric dragon. Yay! It literally has electricity coming off of it. At least that's what it looks like. Yay. And it is... Shocking my kobold again. Yes. Oh god. Never stop falcon ruining. Strike by Cold. Girl Strike by Axeman. And Dragon Breathe Fire on us. Well then. A bit more that time. Eh. That's how much I have. That guy likes to shock the kobold with his lightning attack. That is... Favoritism. Favoring things that do not have fur on them. 
So technically humans are disliked by this guy, I guess. Anyway, we're getting fire on us again. So much fire. So hot. It is super hot. Dragon has been slain. But the cost of making one of my dudes very dizzy, which will be cured when we leave this uh, screen, which is now, so it didn't matter. Into the castle, deeper in, I guess. These guys are chumps. Let's mend our wounds, shall we? It's time to fight Quanda Rosman. We're actually the son of one of the Imperial generals, so we're kind of a big deal. We don't have to do it again? They they once called you Quanda the Insurmountable. What? See the power of the black rune that Lady Windy has given me. That that definitely sounds like heaven. Oh God. Which is tomorrow. And wait, what? It's just a battle between me and him. It's a duel. You strike with all your might. I don't know. Can you give me like fifty dollars? Okay, that was easy enough. Okay. Hopefully I get paid. <laughs> he made a desperate attack. Carefully. Right now I just need enough to make a payment on my credit card, pay our rent, and get my hair cut next week. Alright. I do a normal also, attack. I have to pay off my car. You need, to pay, you need to make a payment on my car. I'll get you! Mm. <laughs> <laughs> 100 damage. Carefully. Damn, my turn! Okay. His turn was to defend, I guess. We're getting nowhere! Here I come! Oh, he made a desperate maneuver that failed miserably. Quan is a very desperate man. Ugh! I skipped that dialogue on accident! Impossible! It's the Black Road! <laughs> and our kobold's like, you mess everyone up, you fix them. And he's like, kobold, but why are you still sane? Ah, my arm! It's glowing! Oh god. Actually, his entire body is glowing, but his right arm is very glowy. Something about Black Rune, according to Victor. And... Ah, that, that's literally the noise that he makes. The enemy, I mean. And he's collapsed on the floor. What happened? Prepare to die. Wait. Kobold, no. Don't kill him. Wait, no, Elf, don't kill him. He doesn't remember a thing. You think. Wait a minute, something's wrong. My axe man goes. Are you Xavius? Please take my head. 
something's wrong. What are you waiting for? Lop off his head. Wait, you're referring to yourself in the third person now? Damn it. Even the kobold's like, you're not the same person. It's this, the burnt rune. There's like, rune? This was the black rune. Lady Windy gave it to me. It gave me power over monsters. I want him to join us. He knows about the Emperor. We must know. You served the Emperor for ten years. You're expect yes, we are expecting you to betray him. Perhaps the one I trusted disappeared years ago. All right, we've recruited a person who was genocidal, but then had a memory wipe. And the kobolds have returned to normal. Yay, for normalcy. Village is gone. The war isn't over yet, goes the elf. At least, the war isn't over until your war is over. Let me join your army. And the other elves are joining us too, it looks like. Could be dangerous. No, I'm staying with you. Okay. And fast elf joins us too. Yay. The kobold joins us. Country is still sick. Awesome Sword Lady joins us. And our strategist tells us that we've become a man. Well then. So many people are willing to join you. Let's go back to Trunk Castle. Let's go then. I might as well. Well. Three months after defeating Quanda Rossman's army... Yes, we fast forward three months later. Oh, young master, what happened? Uh, I went to sleep and it's only three months passed. Oh, I don't have the person that makes me speedy. How unfortunate. Uh, you don't speak in the second person at all, Cleo? You, you say Master Xavius is thinking about Tio, and I'm Master Xavius, and I'm talking to you. That's weird. This guy's like, where's my food? Period. No. No question marks. Okay. There's a question mark over there. Well then. Is that a quest? I don't know. It's a, a point of interest, probably. Hi, Luke. What do you want? Load the map, please. Okay. Two, three, six, ten, We have 39 out of the 108 people that you recruit in this game. Damn. Some of them are NPCs, but yeah. There's 108 people yeah, that joined you in this game, including Holy yourself. Shit. Ow, I got shot by a turret. Yeah, you did. Well then. That's true. <laughs> Looks like important business in that room, not going there just yet. Hey, it's the guy that installed this elevator in my castle. 
Yes, he literally joined us just so he could install an elevator in our castle. Mr. Grenade at me. This person just talks I about things that are interesting, I guess. This guy made a bath for us. This guy has a secret them. vault. Yes, I do have business in your vault. I have business in their vault, too. It's a reload, you ass. Oh, apparently Kwanda wears the halves things. That's interesting. Are about detaching other weird shenanigans later. Let's explore around the base a bit more. We see that. One collection of tools that we have here goes our one guy, Moss. Exploring the rest of my castle, we recruited a few bandits a while ago. What one of them misses what? the easy-going bandit life, what the other one just ass? goes, heh, all the time. He's weird. Yo, when are you planning on paying me what you owe? Uh, we have a castle. <laughs> we have a castle. <laughs> Yo, Chandler, uh, guy from Friends, what do you have for sale? You have all the things for sale. Including this turtle shell. Including this turtle shell. Well, okay, technically it's something called a turtle crystal, but it's like a turtle shell. Close enough. Oh, hey, it's the gambler dude. I'm just fuck up right there. I'll, ha I'll uh, gamble from later, I guess. We recruited an in person at the inn and a chef that <clears throat> doesn't do anything other than look like a chef. And maybe you can take him out for combat. Sword lady is like, if I stay away from Bell for a while, my hands ache with bloodlust. Okay, we we need you on the team always, so you don't uh, like kill us or something. I'm getting in it. Person wearing a weird bow thing. Her uncle trickster guy won't teach her lessons. We recruited a guy named Lapant a while ago. La Pant. La Pant. We're gonna see La Pant. Right here. He's amazing. His portrait has him shirtless. He has a nice mustache. And he's beefy. His name was La Pant. La Pant. La Pant. We'll defeat the Imperials together. And we'll wrestle in the mud together as well, for we are manly men. Wait, why don't you take off that bandana and that weird, uh, suit? Wh whatever. It, it doesn't matter. Just reviewing all the things at this base. Including the fact that we have a dungeon. Oh, shit, boy. Yes, we have a dungeon and... Oh, oh, hey, it's the mage. Flanked? It's the uh, blinky person that we found. Uh, we're we're not teleporting right now. Sorry. Hey, asshole. We found weird uh, trickster uncle, and we found 
creepy guy that says he he at the end of most of his dialogue options. Oh god. He -he. <laughs> this is just gonna be a slaughter fest. That's yeah, pretty much. That's what this is. is he dead? Not quite. I hope so. Oh, Alright, so... We're going to save here before progress occurs. I'm not an animal, fuck you. I'm not an animal either. Well, actually, he was. Why would you want to fuck, though? Anyway, this Ow, is the end at. of the stream, I think. Thanks for sticking around, second viewer. In case you enjoyed this stream, be sure to follow me on the Twitch. And if you're watching this on YouTube later, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye. <laughs>